Uh, how is everyone today? I hope everyone's doing well. Um, I had a little bit of a dream, a closed eyed vision type dream this morning. Um, very interesting. It was a snake, and the snake kind of had a sharp looking head, and it was bright black and white, and it had diamonds on its back. Um, and it, it reached its head up, and all of a sudden its head twisted around, and it was bam, smacked on this big old rock, and it was killed. And that was it. And I thought, oh, wow, does that mean, you know, Satan is, is going to, you know, be dead in, in, in the lake of fire and all that someday? And yes, of course, it means that. I mean, gosh, we know how the book ends, so praise God. But, um... And I was, I was thinking about some other things. Um, I was looking at scripture and about snakes, and I found one in Luke 10, um, 19. Behold, I give unto you power to tread on serpents and scorpions and over all the power of the enemy, and nothing shall by any means hurt you. So I'm like, whoa, that's awesome. Thank you, Jesus. This is such good news. I just feel that the Lord is telling us that in these last days we may see some awful things coming, but He's going to protect those He loves before He takes us home. So I don't know how much we're going to see, but I think it's going to be uh, some not not great things, but uh, be comforted, be encouraged. Um, his Word tells us that you know we're going to have power over the enemy and because we love him and he's coming for us, um, he's going to protect us. And um, while we're going through some things here and right now, every day, people, we need to go after those who are lost. Any person that the Lord puts in your path, we need to tell them about Jesus no matter what. Um, it's just about time. It's just about time. And you know the interesting thing, I was looking at this, the snake, and the closest I could come to what it looked like was um, an eastern diamondback snake, and uh, it's interesting, the place that this snake, the geographical location of this snake is in the southeastern portion of the United States, so like South Carolina, Florida, Louisiana, Georgia, that kind of area. So I'm just wondering if, if that has any meaning as well. Um, some not, not good things coming for that area of the United States. I don't know. Um, if you have any ideas, please let me know. Please leave a post if you have any discernment regarding this little dream here about the snake. But um, it is pretty interesting. Um, the Lord's coming soon. We, we all know that. It's going to be like any time. And um, I do believe Luke ten nineteen also lets us understand that as we are protected, the Lord's going to pass over us with any, any horrific things coming. He's going to protect us. And huh, the Passover, second Passover is Friday the 22nd, so many other things going on. It's the UN vote against Israel. God help them. Oh my gosh, it's just crazy. And then also the, um, the sign of Jonah is this weekend. So many things, people. I mean, it's, it's so close. The Lord is going to just show up any moment and He is going to you know, the trumpet's going to sound, and with his his large voice, he's going to just come up hither. We're going to be gone, and uh, it's going to be any time soon. So please hang in there, people. Be encouraged. Hang in there. He loves us so much. Um, stay close to the Lord. Um Anyways, I just wanted to share this little dream with you, and if you have any anything to post, um, any discernment, please share it.
I love you all, and I pray for you all. God bless you. I hope you guys have a great day in the Lord, and look up, because our King is coming soon.